Losing control of your vehicle on a slippery, wet road can be scary. But did you know that you can prevent these accidents from happening? Let's talk about Bosch's anti-lock braking system and electronic stability program and keep you and your family safe on the road. Joining us today is the Managing Director of Bosch Philippines, Richard Walker. Good morning, Kiko. Hello, Richard. Thank you for inviting me. Richard, the first time I heard of ESP, the first thing that came to my mind was extrasensory perception. But that's not what our ESP stands for, right? No, Kiko, no, no. ESP stands for Electronic Stability Program. You could say it helps perceive and avoid obstacles in the road and keep you safer. Can you tell us more on how ESP works? ESP works by detecting if your vehicle is going to go into a skid or a spin situation. Mm -hmm. And it can make compensation to avoid that from happening. What counts as emergency braking situations? Well, emergency braking system could be when you have to suddenly stop to avoid collision with an object or an obstacle. So ABS works together with ESP? Exactly. Uh -huh. ABS and ESP are actually two systems. The first is ABS, anti-lock braking systems. And this allows you to suddenly stop without getting into a condition of wheel lockup. Once your wheels lock up, you no longer have the ability to stop in a sudden manner, but by using anti-lock braking systems, your wheels never lock up and you're able to stop in a shorter amount of time. Why is it important to prevent your wheels from locking up? Because once the wheels lock up, you're in an uncontrolled braking situation mm -hmm. and you will not stop as suddenly as if you could avoid wheel lock up. But that's useful for sudden stops. But what about if there's a vehicle in front of me and I have to maneuver out of the way? ABS also helps in those cases. It prevents the wheels from locking up and you can steer safely around the vehicle and make sure that you're not gonna have a collision. So ABS and ESP work together to make driving safer? Absolutely, there are uh -huh. two systems, but there's also more. Such as, for instance, traction control. Traction control. Traction control is another technology that, say for instance, you're gonna accelerate from a stop mm -hmm. on a wet or slippery pavement. It allows your uh, wheels to have traction so you can accelerate in a smooth and controlled manner. So traction helps the wheels get a good grip on the road? Exactly, traction control will help modulate the speed of those wheels so that they remain in contact with the road so that you can do a controlled acceleration. Wow, that sounds like some smart technology by Bosch. Just to recap, Safe driving is assisted by several systems, which is ABS, ESP, and traction control system. That's right, Kiko, but that's not the only systems or uh, components that come into play for this technology. What else are there? For instance, uh, there's wheel speed sensors, which detect the rotational speed of your wheels. There's a steering wheel sensor that detects the direction you intend to go. Mm -hmm. And then there's a yaw rate sensor, which detects the angle of rotation of the vehicle. So all of these components work together with your ABS and your ESP system to keep uh, a stable driving situation. That's interesting. One last question, Richard. ESP is available for four-wheeled vehicles, but how about motorcycles? Yeah, exactly. Uh, ESP is available, is, is for four-wheel vehicles, mm -hmm. but we also have technology called Motorcycle Stability Control, or MSC, and also Motorcycle ABS which is available for two-wheelers. Well, maybe we can talk about that for another video, right? Oh, I would love to. I'll be looking forward to it. Thank you, Kiko. And thank you, Richard. For more information about ABS and ESP, you may visit www.bosch.com.ph. You may follow Bosch on Facebook via Bosch Philippines. And don't forget to hit that subscribe button.